Oh, hey, I'm Marigold Bahian. Um, can I take your three minutes? Great, thank you so much. Anyway, have you ever wondered why are we able to know the characteristics of some ancient humans and ancient societies? Why are we able to know their traditions, cultures, economic system, etc.? And why are we able to know the uniqueness of different tribes, although we cannot really encounter them personally? Well, if you want to know the answer, here's Darlene Monsueto to start the discussion. Thanks, Marigold. Moving on. Anthropology is derived from the Greek word anthropos means human being and logos means study. So basically, anthropology is the study of humankind. It studies the Asian societies including the traditions, cultures, language, values, and etc. There are four major fields under these disciplines, namely biological, cultural, anthropological linguistics, and archaeology. This will further discuss by Jason Origines and Abigail Panessa. Thank you, Darlene. First, biological anthropology is the study of human evolution. Remember Charles Darwin theory? Second, cultural anthropology refers to the study and seek to understand cultural features of societies such as marriage, customs, economic system, and kinship. Anthropological linguistics studies the changes and development of human language. Lastly, archaeology. These studies remain fossils, artifacts, and cultural landscapes, and many more. Now that we understand the anthropology, it will be easy for us to know and understand these things, although we did not really encounter them in our real life. Here's Viola Ibanez, Minji Garcia, and Jay Abigurias for further discussion. We are able to know and understand these things because of research. Combining qualitative research and quantitative research have great importance in this discipline. It tends to participate in observing and exploring connections simultaneously amidst cultural differences, alternatives, and identity. Quantitative research is objective and systematic procedure in obtaining quantifiable information about the world, so it may use this experiment just like determining the years of the fossils that they found in the underground. The finding reflects precise and accurate data as it uses statistical tools. It could also help us in investigating human lives through natural and environmental factors in the development of human communities. Through the contribution of quantitative research, the anthropology have made a lot of discoveries like human behavior, racial conflicts, and human evolution that enables the anthropologists to improve, make development, and let the world know about their studies. How nice! You made it to the end. I hope you learned something from this video. Thank you and have a great day.